Hello and welcome back to Bjorn Home, episode 4, Farming Simulator 15 with FS Panda Mushroom. How you doing? I just stopped off, uh, I didn't actually get some fuel, I just went in to have a, you know, yeah, relieve myself. And here's where you would get fuel. There's a couple of uh, fuel stations dotted about, just normal, go up, press R, refuel, jobs are good. I thought I'd just show you that, not that you really wanted to know that I wanted a leak, but yeah, here we are, look at these beautiful houses, They've got some flowers or something, I think we go this way to get home, this there is, what's that place? Let's just have a quick look at the map. Press 9 to get your map up. And that's the grain elevator, so we know where the grain elevator is. Mr. Cedar is still going. Mr. Cedar. Mm, wrong name, let's... Harry. Harry. Harry the Cedar. Harry's going. Sid, Sydney was uh, on the cultivator. Oh, I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> right, I think Sydney's uh, finished over with the cultivator, so we'll go and bring him over. I will just park this out under. I think Sydney wants his um, field uh, spraying, yeah. So what we will do is, oh, we will take over Ari. Okay, Ari, you ready? Okay, dude. So we got three fields at the moment. Um, 24, 29 and I think 30 something I think that one is. So you get to it, you come up the back of the yard, through the yard. There's our lovely house with the sauna, I can have a sauna later, you know. Get a bit of steam into the aching bones. The only thing is, you know, when when, when I take a, a sauna, it sort of puffs up the fur. It's sort of, yeah, you know, afros it. All of a sudden, it just goes poof. And, yeah, it, it just, just looks wrong, but never mind. Right. Got a nice tent there. <laughs> so here's our other field. This is 38. There is a couple of other different ways to get to it, and yeah, mm, I don't know it. I will do. So, Ari's going to put down some more uh, wheat. He's planting wheat again. Uh, why not? Why not? There you go, Ari. Go for it, mate. Get over into Sydney's tractor because he's cleared off. I don't know where he's gone. Sydney! Sydney! Where are you gone? He's gone home. Is it this way? Whoa, whoa, whoa. You'll notice this if you go too fast, you will slide all over the place with these tractors. You have to take your foot off the uh, accelerator and gently curve them round because I just I keep my foot on the uh, gas and there you go, look at that, drift away. Whoa, where are we off to? Whoa. So 
So you can't go crazy but out of L. Well, I'll put him over here because he's going to need to do his field. What I'm thinking, what I'm thinking, <laughs> okay, Sydney. See, look at him, he's struggling. He's five mile now, that's great, isn't it? Aha, uh -huh. we need to fertilize. Whoa, his field. Off we go. Off we go. Yeah, what I was thinking is maybe seeing how much. Oh, I've got a butterfly. Maybe seeing how much a snuffler is, aka a um, forage wagon. I know there's a little one in here, a little pottinger, but I don't know how much it is. That snuffles up the grass and the uh, straw, so we can sell it, get a bit of extra moolah. So even though it's going to cost us some money initial outlay, on GPS is probably more efficient but yeah you know so close Harry so close See how much a snuffler wagon costs us. So then we can sell the straw. And then we've got it if we can, you know, need to. Or oh, need. We need. We need everything. We just started. But when we get into cows, because I like my panda cows, my black and white ones. The brown and white ones are all right, but they're not quite panda cows. Not quite got the same, but yeah. So they're going to need straw and a way to get it in. So the snuffler wagon. <laughs> ah dear. The forage wagon. How's that? I'll put it better. The forage wagon will come in handy later on down the track. So we will go in the shop and see how much that is. We've almost seeded, earned uh, seeded. We've almost fertilised this. Right, in fact, we have fertilised this. We will take this back. Maybe I don't need all these tractors. Um, I could sell one, possibly. But at the moment, you know, I'm not. I don't have a lot of money, but I'm not bleeding for money. So until I start really seriously having trouble with money, then nah, I don't think I need to worry about getting rid of a tractor yet. And we've not got any chickens yet. And I've not found a shotgun um, mod yet for that rooster. So as I was saying in the last one, uh, if you wait for it to rain, it does wash the tractors. But even if you're inside, you know, it's still got the 2013 bug, whereas if you're inside, you still get wet. Yeah, that's good. So you could save your money and not buy your carcher washer, which is 5k. But some people like having spick and span um, 
equipment, which is a good thing, which is a good thing. But I think it looks cool and groovy, dirty. A bit of rolling in the mud, never a pandy, you know. Okay, let's see here. Alright, let's have a quick look in the old shop. We're looking for a loading wagon. Uh, the little pottinger, 27,000 we need. Because that one, 60 horsepower. Yeah, okay. We'll put it on, I will put it on the back of the early man. Um, this one, 180 horsepower. This one, 240 horsepower. Some of them actually tell you that the tractor is not powerful enough for the implement. So, you know, just be aware of that. The Hurleyman, um, I was just going to apologise. Hurleyman is supposed to be rated at 90 horsepower. So I will put the Pottinger on the Hurleyman and we will see it struggle. Because you're only supposed to need a 60 for this. You, we will end up um, swapping over to an Agrostar for it, I would say. But watch this space. Right, what are we going to sell this time? Let's just have a look, see what's the best price we can get for what we got now. Uh, we've got rid of our canola. So we're looking at probably barley. We can get rid of some barley. For. Whoa! Is that right? 739? Yeah, that's a good price. 739 for at the grain elevator, which is just down the road. Oh, that's cool. I get rid of our barley there. Let's have some of that. Oh look, silo is empty. Here's some barley then D. See if I move forward you can see it filling in different places. Cool in it, it's cool. They all things please me. <laughs> oh dear. Grain elevators this way, I'm sure it is. Just check. Grain elevator. Uh, yeah. Up near Ari. I hope you've all been well and uh, had a good time and enjoying uh, the series playing loads yourself really getting into it and you have got indicators, I don't know if I've said this before if you want indicators, one, two, three on your numpad uh, will I use them? probably not here you go, I'll, I'll use them for this this time, there you go we're, we're indicating to get into there, there you go. But it doesn't cancel itself, so you have to cancel it. Ah oh dear. Oh, and there's a waybridge. Let's go over the waybridge. Probably coming the wrong way then. Let's see. We're 8,208. Okay. Now is that kilos, tons, or what? Don't really say, really. Well, that must be the right way, because uh, there's no display on the other side. Okay, let's unload. Unload our barley and get our moolah ticking up. Come on, come on, how much can they give us? How much? Come on. Ooh, 19. We're going to need about 30,000 because. 
And we could store some vehicles here. Oh, there's another way bridge there as well. Mm. Interesting. Yeah, because we need some money to tick over by, don't we? And obviously we've got the loan to pay back and the, the bank sort of nabs the interest and obviously it's early game so we're about to have a bit of a loan. What are they on? I'm sorry, I'm just curious of what I've got on the top of my house. Are they horses or dogs or what are they? Answers on a postcard. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, what's this? We just found a gold coin. Two of 100. <laughs> Ah uh, dear, I don't think we're going to find all 100, but I've heard, mm, if you don't want to listen to this, cover your ears a sec, once you get to 10, it sort of reveals where they all are, which sort of defeats the object. Yeah. So, yeah, no, not good, no, not good. There you go. Right, what next to sell? What next to sell? I think it don't really matter what we sell, we just sell it and get the money for it. So we just make our way through. Um, I might keep hold of uh, the wheat for the minute. Let's go corn then. Corn looks really groovy here. Okay, where are we going to sell the corn? See, I could have put this up on, you know, on... That's the only one of the bugbears, I suppose. Uh, could have put this on the PDA and still drove to see where I was going. Corn. We've got Freight Yard 379. Uh, grain Elevator. Oh no, Shipping Office. Oh, Transport Company. Yep, Transport Company. Okay. Well, we've been to the Transport Company. Let's go a different mm, Go this way. Because we went and come back through. The only thing with the inspector mod is, is the um, cedars are. Um, even though I got it on hard work, if I if I jump in there. If I was at 100% it would be red, which is, yeah, 100% red, full, job done. But because you're in a cedar, if you're 100%, it should be sort of white. And it should be when you're getting down to 5% that it should sort of go red. But, yeah, it's just a little, little niggle, don't worry about it. Oh, and uh, yeah, I've had a couple of... Course play is not out yet. They're going through the beaters at the moment. There was a site that put up course play. It is not correct. Don't go there because um, it's false. I don't know what site it was. It wasn't one of... I think it was MDL or whatever wasn't one of the main ones but they are walk, working on course play so people will be happy it will come along this way 
it straight in front. So there you go. People who love cosplay, they are working on the beta version for 15. I have no idea when it's going to be. Um, just keep your eyes open, really. But make sure it's from the official uh, cosplay site because they've got their own website. And they always do it through mod oasters. Whether they're going to change it this time or not, I don't know. It will go up on other sites as well, but the the main one will probably be mod oaster. Um, have I gone wrong? Can I get up here? Go this way. Way. We get home someday. Ah, yeah, I know where we're going. The sh shop. Yes, is is. I think I know where I'm going. Maybe not. Let's just have a look. What's that place? doesn't say what that place is. Is that just a... This guy have a sneaky beak set. It's just a building, is it? Yeah. Looks like it should be a place. But it's not. Got lots of barriers in and out. Well, yep, panda driving there. This is a big place just to be a big place. Hmm, silos and everything. Obviously not. Okay. carry on round this way then. Probably going the wrong way. Let's just put up the map. Uh, yeah. We're going way over. So we turn left up there. Oh, there's a circus. Woo! Circus is in town. I bet watch that they don't sort of capture me and put me in a cage. Lock of me up. Throw away the key. Ah, there's the wood chip place. Uh, we know where we are now. There's a fuel yard. There's the shop over there. To the right. I mean, I could borrow some more money if I wanted to, but... We sell the stuff, have a jolly wander round, you know. It's all part of the game. Let's turn left up here. This takes us through, back to the yard. Come on, girl. Get up here. Hey, these little uh, smurfots here, they, they make me laugh. Ah, oh, Mum, she'd be well away. Hobbit. She'd have loads of room in that. Okay, okay. Right, so we sold the barley, sold the. Uh, I want to keep hold of the uh, wheat for the minute. So let's sell. What's this? Is this going to be tears? Or 
Not going to be anything if we don't get it in there. Come on, come on, that's it. Yeah, this taters. See what I mean about loading positions? Whoa, Mexican wave. Whee! <laughs> Uh, crazy, crazy panda, crazy panda. Where are we off to with the taters? Shipping office 398. There's only two places to sell your taters anyway. Shipping office or transport company. So it looks like we're off to the shipping company. Shipping office. And that is... That is, that is, that is. Because, you know, we know where everything is, don't we? Not. Shipping office right in the opposite corner. Oh, we've not been there yet. Oh, cool. Wrong button. See, yeah, I'm still not used to the interface on this one yet. Uh, down there, around the corner, left bit, right bit, up and down, over, over, left, right, right, left. There we are. Easy as that, innit? Did you get that? No? Good. Nor did I. We just go around this way then. Whoops. Oops, I don't think I should have done that one, but hey, we are in a four-wheel, well, I, don't, I think this one's four-wheel drive, well, no, actually. Can we get this way? Probably not. We're going the wrong way. That's a good start. So we will turn round. And we'll go that way, that way, no. If we follow this road down, yeah, we follow this road down to that, um, building, that big building that we just had an investigation for but it didn't really do anything you would have thought it would be milkman or something like that wouldn't you? or sugar beet or something we're having an explore we're having an explore So I can't give you all the good toys to start with because you know got to be gentle, break you in easy like. If we nip straight across through the car, yeah, they don't care about me. I don't care about them. Go to the bottom. Turn left. Ah, there's a little chicken icon there, so... Is that... ah, see that? I'll just jump out. Selling point for eggs. There you go, so if you've got any eggs, come here and you sell them. Either go up to it and it goes ka -ching. Gives you lots of mush, mush. Dosh, cash, euros, dollars, whatever. All you have to press R. Another gas station, they're all tucked away all over the gaff. Uh, keep on this road. See, the other thing that, you know, they've done funny shaped fields as well now. They didn't do it last time. It was just all square fields. That was it. But we want 
different shape fields. Yeah, there's a little beach down there. We could go paddling. <laughs> Get our speedos on. <laughs> ah dear, oh what a nasty thought that would be. Panda in speedos. Oh, that's put you off your dinner for life, isn't it? <laughs> oh dear. Uh, there's the circus. Scarred for life. That's what I've done to you. I've scarred you for life. Oh, it's a cool little bridge here, isn't it? Over there. You can hear the river underneath. So is this the place? This could be. This is the shipping office. Down by the water. I can't see many ships, but. I thought they would add a ship moored in the uh, dock or something. Yeah. But hey, never mind. And we will unload. Will we get enough? Come on, gears enough. Ah, oh, you're joking. You're having a Jeffrey geezer. We're just sure. Just sure. So we've got to sell our sugar beet as well in order to get. Ah. Oh. No. No. What I'll do is I oh let's just nip back. See that bit of a skid there. It's over here. Got a bit of an allotment in front of his house and here's the circus. Somewhere over there. Oh, that's the store now, huh? Yeah. yeah. Ah, damn. Ah, we still taking that money. I can't put a PDA up at the moment because it just stops everything. Uh, so I'm probably slightly running over time, but I'll tell you what, we we borrow a couple of quid. I don't want to do it. We borrow a couple of quid. And uh, we get a loading wagon unless we can dump our sugar beet off somewhere very close I'll do that off screen probably so you don't have to suffer at all but we just have a look just before we end the episode I wanted to get enough money for the loading wagon right get over to the uh, sugar beet let's load the sugar beet I know the price has dropped a bit come on load load alright don't load and there you go Just finding the sweet spot. I dig that. I dig that. Right, let's have a quick look, see where we'd take it. See if it's anywhere near and new. If it is new, then I will. I'll do it now. So we've got transport, shipping, 
freight yard. Oh, it's low. It's low at the freight yard, though. We're losing about 100 a ton at the freight yard. <sighs> bit much, bit much. Okay. Well, I will take it over to... Um, shipping yard or something off camera and sell it. Sugar be not accepted here. No. We're not giving it. But because I wanted me little wagon, I'm going over. I'm going to buy it. I'm slightly run over time, I do apologise. But hey, gotta do these things to progress. So, 27,000, so if we borrow 5,000, that should cover it. Um, you can if you want, look, Wait. you can come to this little machine here and press R and you can do it this way, because we owe 115,000 so we borrow another 5,000 which gives us 31,000. We spin round the front. On the shop. I uh, say so you can, if you want, go to the little shopping basket instead of pressing P. Press R there, and we go to loading wagons. Double click on that. Double click on that, and there you go. And this one can take, that's grass, that's straw, and that is chaff. That little symbol. There it is, dropped out of the sky into the floor. And there we go. We have our Pottinger Euroboss. And we'll just hook this up and see how. Uh, now this is empty. I've not got a weight on the front. So it should be interesting. Because this, this tractor is rated at 90 horse, which is. Um, you should only need a 60. But to see, to show you, I mean, most of you probably already know, you probably played the game, so you know what's what. But I just love the way they've done it. it it's. Yeah, it's awesome. And the cars go slower than the tractors still. Come on, dude. I'll never get there if we follow you. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, we're slowing down. We were we're going twenty one. Now we're dropping right down. Eleven. Hey, she's doing all right. She's doing all right. Ah, see, that could be wrong. I thought she might have started struggling a bit. Eleven, ten. Hmm, could be in luck. Could be in luck. There you go, I bought it back to the yard. Park it in the middle of the yard for the minute. And we will call the episode there, finished. Thank you for watching, thank you for staying with me. This is FS Panda Mushroom, you take care till next time. Bye.